Hey y'all, my name is Paula Dean and I've lost 40 pounds. Hi, I'm Michael, I've lost 60 pounds. Hey y'all, my name is Jamie Dean and I've lost 45 pounds. My name is Bobby Dean. A little more than 10 or 12 years ago, I was, golly, I think I was around 205. So I've lost about 30 pounds. As we started working more outside the restaurant, Bobby really took responsibility for his body and uh, spends every day two to three hours in the gym. When I began to change my life, it was started with embracing exercise. And when I started to exercise, it changed my relationship with food. It changed the way that um, I wanted to eat. I began to eat for the way that I wanted to feel. So I went home and I cleaned out my pantry and I cleaned out my refrigerator and I got rid of some of the major culprits. And I learned to live a life uh, more of balance. For me, if I weigh myself and I see that I've gained a couple of pounds from like my comfortable target weight, I know that I need to reel it in a little bit and I'll make some smarter choices throughout the day. But if I stand on the scale and I'm right where I want to be and where I'm comfortable in my walking around weight, that shows me that I'm doing positive things and that helps reinforce me and know that some of the things I may be giving up in the long run are going to make me feel better. I love salads. I, I love to do a chopped salad of about four ounces of tuna or four ounces of steak or four ounces of chicken and cut it up into the chopped salad. Four ounces isn't much, it's about as large as a, a meatball. You know, you learn moderation. If you're committed, you can do it. I think my favorite healthy food to eat now is Brussels sprouts. I have so fallen in love with Brussels sprouts and they make it so easy. They sell uh, fresh Brussels sprouts in a, in a microwavable bag and you just stick them in the microwave, steam them for like the five minutes, and then I saute them in a little drop of butter and a little drop of olive oil mixed in salt and pepper and kind of roast them in the pan until they're brown and they are succulent, y'all.